Hello, and welcome back to another episode of Blade Break. I, Blade Break, am Elliot, joined by Bill. Hello. Doing the Lexi gauntlet type thing again. Uh, we probably don't know what order these are releasing yeah. in, but uh, <laughs> here we are. Uh, today, against uh, Bill's Lexi deck, I am playing Ira Crimson Haze. Uh, she's suited up with two weapons because they are both one-handed ones, a harmonized Kadachi and a Zephyr Needle because Bill's deck does not play defense reactions. That you know of. Mm -hmm. And <laughs> an Iron Rot Helm, a Vest of the First Fist, a Breaking Scales, and Snapdragon Scalers on her feet. Um, don't judge me. <laughs> That's all I'm, gonna, all I'm gonna say about the matter. Okay. The deck isn't perfectly optimized. None of mine, well, maybe like one or two of them are, but uh, don't judge me, thanks. Yeah, reasonable. <laughs> uh, as Elliot mentioned, I am playing Lexi, uh, either for the first time or once again. I don't know. Um, and I'm going to be suited up with Voltaire Strike Twice as my trusty bow. New Horizon on my head. Uh, Fiendel's Spring Tunic uh, on my chest. Bullseye Bracers on my arms and Perch Grapplers on my tootsies. Uh, our loadouts are very similar, I would say. Yeah. 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 Anyway, um, so... I'm, I'm going first. Yeah, Elliot is going first today. All right. So we're yeah. going to kick things off, you know, as a as a ninja deck ought to do. Mm -hmm. uh, I'm going to pitch this uh, yellow flick flack. Horrifying. Uh, it does have zero in its pitch cost, or what cost? Yeah. Just cost. Pitch. Yeah. Uh, so I'm going to use one of them to... Attack for one. I will take one. I will use one of them to do my second attack, which will be for three. I will block three. I will then. Uh, I am then going to play a Whirling Mist Blossom uh, by pitching a red flick flack. Uh, it is an Ira specialization. It is going to be for two. And if it hits and it's the second or higher chain link in a row to hit, I'm going to draw two cards. And it has go again. So currently... It is not the, it, this would be the first in another. In a, in a yeah. row, yeah. Yeah, so I, I took this one, didn't take this mm -hmm. one, then potentially this one. Right. Um, so yeah, since you're not going to be drawing any cards, I'll just take two from that. Okay, uh, I'm going to get greedy here, even though it's turn one for some reason. <laughs> uh, I'm going to break my vest. Yeah. And I'm going to come at you with a flying kick for seven. For seven, hey? Mm -hmm. A red flying kick. Um... That is a lot of damage, but I think I'm just going to block two of it with this Perch Grapplers, and I will take five. Sounds good. So I will go to 12. Okay, that's my turn. All right. Uh, I guess before the end of your turn, I will pitch this blue Frazzle to activate my Voltaire to put this yellow Frazzle into my arsenal. Sounds good. You kick things off by remembering to put a counter on my Spring Tunic. Mm -hmm. It's very important. It is. Uh, I'm going to play this blue Weave Lightning. Uh, next Lightning or Elemental Attack action I play this turn gets plus one. If it's fused, it gains. Go again. Mm -hmm. uh, I'm going to uh, cast, or I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to play this Frazzle from my arsenal, pitching this other yellow Frazzle. Uh, this is also a yellow Frazzle. Uh, so I have one resource floating, and I will fuse it with this Pulse of Volt Haven. Oh. Uh, so it has plus one from this and go again because it was fused and as well because it was fused whenever an attack would deal damage this turn instead it deals that much plus one okay. so I'm attacking you for five potentially six yikes uh, I would like to uh, attempt to just go on the defense here for five that occurs great that is fine uh, I'm going to use this other resource that I have floating to activate my Voltaire strike twice uh, to strike once with this Dazzling Crescendo. Uh, I'm going to give it plus one attack here. And then I'm going to... Actually... Yeah, I'm going to cast this Pulse of Voltaven as an instant uh, to give my next Lightning, Ice, or Elemental attack this turn plus four. And then I will come at you with this Dazzling Crescendo. It has plus one from Voltaire and plus four from Pulse of Voltaven, so it is for nine. 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 And nine. it will deal an additional plus one if it hits you. Ten it is. <laughs> Go to ten. All right. Let's clean up here. Uh, this one breaks. This one gets its battle-worn counter. Okay. Uh, I am going to 
try to attack you with this harmonized Kadachi by pitching a blue rising knee thrust that does have uh, cost zero, so this will have go again. I will take one. Uh, I will remove uh, another of my counters to attack you with this Zephyr Needle for three. I'm going to take three from this Zephyr Needle. Okay. Uh, and then I will finish things off with a Surging Strike pitching this other Surging Strike. They are both reds, uh, so uh, it's coming at you for five. Yeah, I kind of figured that was happening. Uh, I will block four of that. I'm going to throw away my New Horizon. Okay. Please take an additional one. Okay. I'll go to seven. Okay, that is my turn. I'm going to start off by casting this red weave ice to give my next ice or elemental attack action card. I play this turn plus three. If it's fused, it gains dominate. Alrighty. Uh, I'm going to break my bullseye bracers because I have no cards in my arsenal. I can put an arrow from my hand face up into my arsenal. It will be this red dazzling crescendo and it gets plus one until end of turn. Uh, I'm going to attack you with this Dazzling Crescendo uh, for, it has plus one from that, so for eight, and I'm going to fuse it to give it Dominate. Uh, and because it was fused, it has Go again. All right, that is bad, uh, sad bad, <laughs> as we say <laughs> in the business. Uh, I will defend it with the one card from my hand that I can for three. Okay. Uh, so what am I taking, five? You would take five, yes. All right, I will go to five. Yeah, I think I'm just going to attack you also with this ball lightning for one. Becomes two. Yeah, you know, who who needs cards in hand? <laughs> I'll also defend that. I made a very big point about ticking up my spring tunic. Yeah, but we all know it. you're an idiot. I am so. unfortunately very dumb, but I'm super pretty too, so it yeah. balances oh, out. So pretty. <laughs> all right, it is now your turn. Thanks. Well, what do you know? I'm going to attack you. With a harmonized Kadachi pitching this blue soul bead strike. So I will have two resource remaining. Really rude. Mm -hmm. Like really, like like super ridiculous. But one. I'm gonna take one. Yeah. Okay, perfect. No, it's still rude. Yeah, yeah please take way. three. I will not. Oh. I'm gonna block with this yellow buzz bolt. Hmm. Seems rude. Who are you? What? <laughs> I'm just gonna arsenal this last card. Okay. Yeah, that's all I'm doing. Sounds good to me. I'm going to remember this time to put a counter on my spring, spring tunic. That's pretty good. And now has three counters on it. Uh-oh. Yeah. That's the number. Yeah. Uh, I'm going to activate my Voltaire, uh, putting this Bolton shot into my arsenal, pitching this blue Electrify to pay for that action. Uh, so I have two resources floating. I'm going to give this plus one attack. I'm going to fire it at you for free because it is a red buzz bolt for five with go again. And if it hits, I get to reload. That's crazy that you feel that way. Mm -hmm. Unfortunately, this is, uh, what do they call it, lethal? Mm-hmm. Mm -hmm. <laughs> yeah, it would be that, wouldn't it? Mm-hmm. I have no block uh, things. Do you have any attack phase, reactions? Defense phase, reaction step. Yes. I have no attack reactions. Uh, I will defense reaction with a blue flick flack, uh, defending for two and giving the next card I would defend with... Uh, if it has combo plus two. Mm -hmm. uh, so I will take three. Okay. And you may uh, reload and go again. And I stuff. am not going to reload. Dang. Because I want the plus one from Voltaire. So I'm going to activate Voltaire with this to put this buzz bolt into my arsenal, giving it plus one. And I'm going to use my last resource to attack you with it for five. Aha. You fell into my trap. I will block four five with this card with combo. Dang. It do Does it ever have combo? Uh, yeah, that, that happens. So you are at two, I am at six. That is what I see, yeah. And uh, I'll draw some cards. Okay, uh, wouldn't you know it, I'm gonna attack you with a Harmonized Kodachi. Pitching a blue Soul Bead Strike, I will have two resources floating. I'll take the one. Okay, uh, I will remove... I keep saying remove because I'm used to using steam counters. <laughs> These aren't like on the card. Yeah, anyway, yeah. use uh, another one of my resources, Zephyr Needle, for three. For three. Uh, as an instant, I'm going to activate my Findil's Spring Tunic to give me a resource and activate Voltaire to put this Frazzle into my arsenal face up. Then I'm going to block with the Spring Tunic for one. That's crazy. <laughs> it's crazy that that is a thing that you are allowed to do. Yeah, I am right? mad. Right? Yeah, please take two. Yeah, I take two. Okay. Then 
you only went to three, so th this isn't quite as impactful as I would have wanted it to be. Um, but I'm going to try to come at you with a rising knee thrust. Uh, it is just for two. It's just a yellow one. Um, that that's it. I'm going to block with this red Bolton shot for three. Um, I'm going to do some attack reaction -y stuff. I have no defense reactions. I'm going to uh, give target attack action card with combo plus one. Yes. I'm going to give target attack action card with cost one or less go again. Okay. I am going to give target ninja attack action card plus one and draw a card. Yes. Uh, please take one. I will take one. I would like to attack you with a red soul bead strike for four. I will block with this red snapshot for three. All right. And take I'll take one. one. Uh, and I will pass my turn. Okay. Yeah. I'm going to attack you with this frazzle from my arsenal, pitching this red weave ice to pay for it. For uh, five. Yeah. Five. Well, I would like to not die. Hmm. Uh, so I will defend that with this crane dance uh, for three. Mm -hmm. And then as a defense reaction, unfortunately, I also have to use this yellow flick flack. Uh, so that defends for a total of six. Yes, it does. Uh, I will clean up and draw some cards. Alrighty. I now currently have you in, in what we like to call the, the sweet spot uh, yes. as a ninja, where uh, I would like to attack you for lethal with this harmonized Kadachi by pitching this blue rising knee thrust. Block with this blue frazzle. I will like to attack you with this Zephyr Needle for three. Block for three with this yellow Heaven's Claws. Uh, and I would like to attack you with this red blackout kick for four. Block for five. Dang. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, I'm just gonna draw and pass. Oh, cool. I would like to attack you with a harmonized Kadachi by pitching this blue whelming gust wave. Uh, I'll block with this three of a kind. Okay, uh, I will use another resource to attack you with this Zephyr Needle for three. Block with this red frazzle. Uh, I would like to attempt to hit you with a Red Soul Bead Strike for four, and if it hits, it will have go again. You know what also happened if it hits? Uh, you die. Yeah. Yeah, crazy. Uh, yeah, I will block with this red headshot from my hand. Do you have any attack reactions? I do not. Okay. As uh, a defense reaction, in my defense reaction step, uh -huh. I'd like to give target attack action card with cost one or less, one or less plus three attack. You may do that. Okay. Uh, so now it's for seven? Okay. 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 Okay, I go again? Yeah. Okay. 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 <laughs> uh, I was actually really worried that you wouldn't be able to do it that turn because I drew just a bunch of really poopy <laughs> cards. <laughs> just a bunch of blue pitch uh, yeah. zero costs at the wrong time almost. Yeah. But uh, if I was down to, if I had one more HP, I think. I might have been able to pull it out of there, but I was in a, I was in a rough spot. Like, yeah, the, as soon as Ira gets your foot on her neck, or her foot on your neck, yeah, that's how that this is supposed to go. So <laughs> your um, foot on her neck. Yeah. She's into that. Yeah, I, I don't know. I'm not I'm here to shame. Her. Um, but yeah, that was just a, a really rough situation for this deck to be in because I want to be able to attack you for enough that like you're not able to swing it back and yeah. gain tempo. Um, but as soon as I have to block with my whole hand, basically the game's over. So, yeah. Yeah, you you played that very well. You blocked efficiently. The and flick flacks are, you know, killer. Flick flacks sure. are so good. <laughs> yeah, like... I remember when we were first starting and we were opening boxes of uh, Welcome to Wraith and we were looking at flick flack and we're like, what does this card do? This card's bad. Yeah. Like, <laughs> it, it, what? And no, it's like the most insane ninja card in the game, I'm pretty sure. Yeah, like <laughs> on top of everything else, it's zero and the yeah. blue one's pitch for three. Yeah, the red one is a free block for four that also blocks for an additional two, potentially. Like, it's a zero block for six. Yeah. That's just a carrion husk. It's crazy. Yeah. It <laughs> you get to run two crazy. of them. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. But uh, yeah, anyway, thank you guys again for tuning in. Uh, this was a very fun game, and we will see you guys in the next one. Peace out. Hey, thanks for checking out the Spike Feeders on YouTube. Before you close the window, make sure you click subscribe for more great flesh and blood content.